Greetings fellow humans, Bad Mark here with another transmission from Mech Tech Keyboards and today it's another quickie switch review. We're taking a look at the Otemu Jerry Clicky Switch. Yes, it is a clicky. Now, the specs on, these, on this switch is as follows. It has a full 4mm total travel, so no long pull. We have a 2.2 work travel with a 55 gram workforce, a 70 gram tactile force, and a tactile travel of 1.8 millimeters with the minimum trigger force of 30 grams and a bottom out of 80 grams though. Though it does feel heavy, it doesn't feel 80 grams heavy. Now we are dealing with your uh, standard Otemu wing latch switches and it does look like we have a PC top. I would guess probably a nylon bottom but I don't know what to guess on the click jacket. This is a slight bit different than other click jackets that I've seen. It has the dustproof stem, and actually, there is the tiniest amount of lubrication on here. We also have this, I believe it's 21 millimeter, two stage gold spring. So, as far as clickies go, this, I mean, this is made of some good materials. I like clickies, but modified clickies. And um, check out my blueberry lime or blueberry lemon Franken switch, and you'll see what I'm talking about if you're interested. But this switch, I gotta say, it's interesting for being a clicky, and it's one of the clickies that I think I'd like to do the modification that I do to. I basically turn it into a very loud tactile. I mean, they are a tactile from that bump, and that that is a satisfying bump, but. I don't know. I don't know how to describe the sound of the clicky. So I went ahead and loaded up under D, F, and G is the Jerry clicky. And under J, K, you know, because I don't have any other clickies on hand at the moment, but I will be getting some. Under the J, K, and L, I have the Akko CS Vintage White Switches stock. So let's go ahead and see what the Jerry sound like first. Compared to the Akko White. So it is definitely an interesting uh, clicky. Um, unfortunately, like I said, I don't have any other clickies to kind of test against, but it is heavier, which I like. And even though it comes lubricated, I can't tell if, well, it, it, there is a bit of a metallic sound in there. So I don't know, it could be coming from the leaf spring. But other than that, I like that it's heavy. If you guys have any questions about this or any other switch I've reviewed, please feel free to drop me your questions down in the comments below, and I'll do my best to answer them as quickly as possible. Until the next transmission, keep calm and keyboard on.